For this, we're going to need a shuffled deck of cards in addition to a shuffled deck of cards. We're also going to need a set of dice. Now, whenever I do tricks on this page with dice, people always insist that they're loaded, but I'll roll them a few times so that you can see that they are not uh, loaded. You can see different numbers come up each time. In addition to regular dice, we're also going to need cards selected from the deck. Uh, I'll hold it up to the camera. Just remember that card. I don't know what it is, but remember that card. Uh, we will cut that card back into the deck and I will give the cards a few shuffles. And again, I know you're going to say they're loaded, so I'll roll them a few times just so you can see that different numbers come up every single time. Of course, after the cards are shuffled, they always have to be cut. That's very important. And uh, we'll stay with the theme. I'll give the cards a, a one-handed cut as well. We'll roll the dice and then I'm going to deal down to that number. But to prevent bottom dealing, a chip, uh, second dealing, I will deal the cards like this on the table. Two for the blue two. Three for the red and then three, four, the green. One, two, three. And uh, the part that I don't really understand is why the card that you selected is always at that position. I just don't know how it works. 